All right, next up is Oromoth the Sea Titan. He's roughly about 650 blocks from the center. He spawns tentacle adds. He's only got 90,000 life. He's not nearly as strong as the other ones. But the neat thing about him is you gotta fish him up. So you gotta make an export lure and you gotta fish him up. So let's go ahead and do that. Screen. All right. So we go to our old trusty table. I actually found him. We're sailing along and the waypoint. I found this guy. This is what his arena looks like. I'll just be by some waypoint about 650 blocks from the center. And it's going to look like this. And there's going to be little whirlpools in the middle. And this outside ball is indestructible. I need an expert lore. I think I set the stuff aside. Octarine bars and ancient gemstones. Got a whole bunch of that stuff cooking, thankfully. There we go. And my purple lore. Where did I put that sucker? Uh, Alright, so then we can make an exp expert lure. Got that. Now we need a fishing rod. There it is. Alright. So let's try this out. Did I bring some buff foods? Probably. Also, by the way, if you're doing this boss fight, you might want to have a boat. Alright, let's teleport to him and take this guy out. Honestly, I'm not sure how I should do to set up this arena. Wonder if I should connect all these platforms. It might let me. Yeah, you can build in here. I'm not sure if there's a benefit to this or not, but I'm going ahead and do it. time doing this guy so supposedly I have to fish out of these whirlpool things how much space I'm gonna need and everything too all right well let's get preliminary buffs up get out my pets I'm doing a minion build on this one which is kind of nice I got four minions and it gives me basically magic barrier for each minion out which is huge probably one of the more tankier setups so I'm up to 238 energy shield with 700 or 730 life so that's nice okay it's going to be equipped and offhand Here we go. 
And I got him. All right. Now I gotta put my weapons back on. Rip. Let's get buffed up now. No match for my little bats from hell. Oh, They're just wrecking them. They hurt. Why did his tentacles just disappeared? Oh, I see. They broke the blocks. I see. They're spawning and breaking the blocks. We need to build some more blocks. Okay. That's a lot of tornadoes. My goodness. wasn't too bad because I could definitely see this being more difficult if you're a lower power level. Ormoth chest plate. 41 health, 20 armor, 7.1% 7 .1 damage. Melee and range. Oh, this is nice. This is actually a really nice chest piece. Wow. Figurine. Not sure what that does. A moonstone. Look at this big worm coming through here. I think that's another boss. I didn't have my shield on. I had to it either. Oh man, I need the items to summon that guy. Twenty fifty-eight percent damage taken is absorbed by your mana pool. Can be equipped in offhand. I don't know if that's. Uh... I'm not sure. I mean, I guess that's useful if you're not using your magic. That's kind of nice. Kind of like Mind Over Matter from a certain other game. Give me two chess pieces. Very interesting. Let's see what his power gives me. Three percent on range hit to spawn a tornado. All right, so we can spawn the tornadoes now. I love ranged attacks too. So Sola Orama. Sweet. All right, guys. Well, that is Oramoth. Thanks for watching.